we didn't ever talk about this on the show, and then we'll get out of here. What did you think of Stephen Fulton versus Brandon Figueroa? We never touched on that. I thought it was a really good fight, one of the best of the year. Um, I just thought that hit the little cleaner work is what did it for me compared to the volume of punches. Uh, but it was really close. I couldn't argue with it when, if it went either way. I'm just a fan of cleaner shit, and I just thought it was a little bit – his punches meant a little bit more than Figueroa's did. I'm going to say this in the nicest way possible. It's one of the fights that was so good, but it also made me tune out because it felt like every round was the same round in a good way. Like, do you know what I mean? Like every, like every single round was kind of the same thing where it's like Fulton doing his thing on the outside, Figueroa charging. Okay. They're going to grind it out. And I was just waiting for someone's will to break and neither guy folded. And I think that that was kind of like my takeaway from it is, how friggin' tough are both of these men? Yeah, the only separation I saw, and I saw a lot of people brought it up, that maybe he may have been hurt once. Fulton may have been hurt once. That was maybe the only um, advantage I gave to Figueroa. But like I said, it just seemed like his punches meant a little bit more. Um, but I couldn't argue either way. It was, it was a good fight. Yeah, I think it's going to be one of those fights. See, the problem is, like, when we're making our fight of the year list stuff, it's like, to me, Fury Wilder's number one. And then you got fights like Crawford Porter. They're on that list, right? And it's like, you can put Figueroa Fulton on that list to me, but were we really the same level of excited in that fight as we were for Fury Wilder? No, no, not at all. And that's kind of what I'm saying. It's like, this fight to me was a very, very good fight that I enjoyed in an evening. Fury Wilder was a night where I had some of my friends over and it's like something I'm going to remember for the rest of my life. That's how amazing that fight was. And I think that when we think of the fight of the years, it's not the really good fights. It's the fights we remembered for the rest of our time. Any other boxing news you want to give the general world, Mark? What's up, everybody? It's your good friend, Lukey, and I appreciate you watching this video. Now... If you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to the channel, leave a comment with suggestions, which is the reason you're seeing this video. And also, if this is just a single video and you're saying, where's the full interview? Look at the upper left-hand corner and you can find the full interview or check in our video section. We're rapidly trying to improve this channel and it takes support from not just myself, but also people that enjoy the channel to keep me motivated and try to give you the best boxing content. Be sure to go to itrboxing.com for all of your boxing needs. This is Luke.